I'm Jim. I'm Zach. And we are Jimmy Eat World. Yeah, and the sun's coming out, which is good. We've only been here a short while though, so we don't have a we haven't been able to really form our opinion of the download festival yet, but so far so good. It looks pretty pretty gnarly. I mean it's still kinda early in the day and the main stage is packed. It should be a really rocking time. We uh Jim and I when we first uh, started playing together, we were in like junior high and we'd play like Metallica songs and so we have a little bit of metal in us I guess. We're gonna play some old songs, then we're gonna sacrifice goats, and then we're gonna play the new songs. You gotta break it up, you know. It's if you just if you just play the whole time, it's kind of not as interesting as if you have animal sacrifice halfway through. Well, the way we do it is we just slit their throat, and that's usually that usually does the trick. And then we drink the blood. It's a it's a family show, really. Our songs have so much singing in them that it's kind of I can't get away from the microphone for long. I mean, I guess I could wear a headset mic, but that's not really that rock and roll anymore, I guess. The I question know. is, what is Paul Stanley making up for? Why does he have to do that? Why does he have to fly on wires? Paul Stanley can pull it off, you know. He's got a really good chest, you know, and it's nice and hairy. And the hair is really even, I've noticed, with Paul Stanley's chest. It's like, there's not like really a more dense spot. It's really even. And, uh, it, you know, he's got a nice chest. You gotta work on that shit every day, man. Yeah, he does probably a lot of push-ups. After this little festival run, we'll go back home and uh, then do some more North American dates. We're going to play all across Canada, which should be very nice in the summertime. And, uh, you know, start working on new stuff.